Welcome to Pre-Math. In this video, we have got this uh, semi-circle uh, with the center O oh, and this uh, yellow quarter circle put together as you can see in this given diagram where the radius uh, of this uh, yellow quarter circle is uh, 8 uh, units. And now our task is uh, to calculate the area of this uh, purple uh, shaded region. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. And please keep in mind that this figure may not be 100% true to the scale. Let's go ahead and get started. And here's our very first step. Let's focus on this uh, yellow quarter circle. And we can see this uh, is the radius of this quarter circle. And likewise, uh, this is the radius of this quarter circle as well. And both of them are uh, 8 units. So therefore, uh, this quarter circle radius is going to be equal to 8 units. And here's our next step. Let's focus on this uh, semicircle with the center O. Oh, we can see this uh, AO is the radius of this semicircle. I'm going to label that one as uh, lowercase r. And likewise, uh, this uh, OC length uh, as radius uh, lowercase r as well. Therefore, now our task is uh, to calculate the value of this uh, radius lowercase r. And now let's focus on this uh, right triangle uh, ABC. And now let's make an observation. We can see this high part in use uh, AC is going to be lowercase r plus lowercase r is going to give us uh, 2 times uh, r. And we are going to apply the Pythagorean theorem on this uh, triangle. And here's our Pythagorean theorem, a square plus b square equal to c square. And in our case, our two legs are uh, 8 uh, and 8. And our hypotenuse is uh, 2 times r. So let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this Pythagorean formula. So we got uh, 8 square plus uh, 8 square equals to 2 times r whole square. Let's simplify. That is going to give us uh, 64 plus 64 equals to 4 times uh, r square. Let's add these numbers. That is going to give us uh, 128 equals to 4 times uh, r square. And now we are going to divide both sides by 4. This 4 and 4 is uh, gone. So therefore, uh, our r square value turns out to be 32. And now I am going to undo this uh, square by taking a square root uh, on both uh, sides. And here we can see square and square root undo each other. So therefore, uh, our radius uh, lowercase r is going to be equal to 4 times uh, square root of 2 units. So therefore, our uh, semicircle radius uh, turns out to be 4 times square root of 2 units. So therefore, uh, this uh, radius uh, r is going to be 4 times square root of 2. And likewise, this radius r is 4 times square root of 2 as well. And now let's make an observation. We can see the purple shaded region area. We are talking about uh, this uh, purple shaded region uh, area is going to be equal to the semicircle uh, area. We are talking about this uh, whole uh, semi-circle uh, area plus the area of the triangle ABC. We are talking about this uh, triangle uh, ABC area minus uh, the yellow quarter circle area. We are talking about uh, this uh, yellow quarter circle uh, area as you can see in this given uh, equation. So therefore now our task is uh, to calculate the area of this uh, semi-circle the area of the triangle uh, ABC and finally we are going to calculate the area of this uh, yellow quarter circle uh, as well. And now we are going to calculate the area of the semicircle. And now let's recall the area of a circle formula area equals to pi r square where r is the radius of this uh, semicircle. So therefore uh, the semicircle area is going to become uh, pi r square and we are going to divide it by 2. And in our case, uh, the semicircle uh, radius is uh, 4 times square root of 2. Let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this formula. So we got uh, pi divided by 2 times uh, 4 times uh, square root of 2 
whole uh, square. And now we know that uh, 4 times square root of 2 whole square is uh, 32. So therefore, if we simplify, we are going to get pi divided by 2 times uh, 32. And that is going to be equal to 16 times uh, pi. So therefore, uh, the semicircle uh, area turns out to be 16 times pi. And likewise, we are going to calculate the area of this uh, yellow quarter circle. And now once again, let's recall the area of a circle formula, area equals to pi r square. And since we are dealing with the quarter circle, so the area of this quarter circle uh, formula is going to be pi r square divided by 4. And we can see the quarter circle radius uh, is uh, 8. So let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this uh, formula. So it's going to be pi divided by 4 times our radius is 8 uh, whole square. Let's simplify furthermore the right hand side. We got uh, pi divided by 4 times uh, 64. And if we simplify furthermore, that is going to give us uh, 16 times uh, pi. So therefore, the quarter circle area turns out to be 16 pi square units as well. And in this uh, next step, we are going to calculate the area of this uh, right triangle uh, ABC. And now let's recall the area of a triangle formula. Area equals to a half times the uh, base times the height. And in our case, uh, the base of this triangle is uh, 8, whereas the height of this triangle ABC is uh, 8 as well. So therefore, the area of this uh, triangle ABC is going to be a half uh, times our base uh, is 8, times our height is 8 uh, as well. And if we simplify everything on the right hand side, that is going to give us uh, 32. So thus the triangle ABC area turns out to be 32. And here is our final step. Let's recall this equation once again. We know the purple shaded area is equal to the area of the semicircle that we figured it out as 16 pi plus the area of the triangle uh, ABC which is 32 and minus uh, the area of this uh, yellow quarter circle which is uh, 16 pi. Let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this uh, equation. So we are going to write down uh, 16 pi plus uh, 32 minus uh, 16 pi. And now we can see this uh, negative 16 pi and this 16 pi, they cancel each other out. So therefore, our purple shaded area turns out to be 32 square uh, units. So thus the purple shaded region area turns out to be 32 square units. And that's our final answer. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.